Hi everyone, welcome back to The Crafty Author. My name is Anissa, I am The Crafty Author, and welcome to my quilting studio. Well, today I'm going to be showing you what came in my new Sew Sampler monthly subscription box by The Fat Quarter Shop. Um, <clears throat> this is something that I've been doing that is new this year, and I'm super excited about it because they send all kinds of goodies. Um, if you haven't seen my January video, my unboxing for this, then you'll definitely want to check that out and maybe spoil yourself by getting yourself this box. I absolutely love the things that I'm getting in the box. So last month was awesome. So I'm excited to see what's in this month. As you can see, I have not opened it yet. So it's going to be a surprise for me as well. And, um, I was going to just give you a really quick update on the um, Hunter Star quilt. So I touched on this um, on Tuesday, but I wanted to let you know that I am still working on that. So I am still getting sewing pieces together and things like that. Um, and the reason that I'm behind is because yesterday was my son's birthday. And then today is my aunt's retirement party. So I've just been a little bit kind of crazy with stuff so <laughs> in case you're wondering so anyway here is the sampler box let's open it up I cannot wait to see what is in here okay enjoy the little things it says February 2023. I wonder what this could be. Oh my gosh. So if you get the um, box, what I've noticed is that there's like a, a coupon on the inside, on the opposite side of your insert here um, to where you can go and get stuff from Fat Quarter Shop and you can get a discount. So since I can't tell you what that is. <laughs> we'll just have to move along. Um, here we have another little, um, this is like a, just a little, I don't know what to call this, like a little catalog that shows you, shows you everything that's in your box. So I like to hold on to those too, because it's really cute. Oh my gosh, check this out. Isn't that cute? I love this. So this is a thread stat. So this is a thread grabber. Perfect. Who doesn't need one of those, right? Oh my gosh, I've never seen one of these before. I wanna open it. I need to check it out. Oh, you guys, I'm really getting excited in here now. Maybe I don't know how to use these yet. There we go. You gotta be smarter than the scissors. Those are cool. Those are really cool. They do grab the threads. Wow, that is awesome. Okay, I am excited to try these. I'm gonna be using these on my next, when I'm sewing my stuff together so I can see how that works. Okay, oh nice. I'm really excited about this because look what else came in here. I got some more fabric, the Sun Washed Fabric by Cori Yoder of Coriander Quilts and she is designing for Moda. Look at that, isn't that cute? This is a Jolly Bar. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. This is a Jolly Bar. So a Jolly Bar <clears throat> is five inch by 10 inch squares. Super cute. I cannot wait to open that up. Yay. Okay, let's see what's in here. I'm not sure. Oh, this is like a little needle book. How cute. It's a little needle book by Moda. Look, you can 
put your pins and your needles in here. You can put your some fat folded fabric in there if you want to. You can also put your threads, some scissors, some you know little snips like yeah, those are going to be too big. But you could definitely do that. Plenty of room for all your stuff in here. This is cute. I love these. I have these all over my craft room. Now, these are great. So these are long ballpoint pens. You can never have too many pens, right? So that's what came in this box. Quilty scraps. Let's see. So this is a Quilty Scraps and they are six biodegradable fabric scrap bags. Oh, awesome. So it has dual adhesive strips for both bag closure and bag placement. Stick the squil the squilty. Stick the quilty scraps bag wherever you are sewing. Oh my gosh. So you could be working on a project and you know you're gonna have some scraps that you need to pull out of a bag or put into a bag. This is what these are for. This is awesome. Let's open it up and see what this looks like. These are by Riley Blake. Look at that. Oh, that is so cool. It even says quilty scraps on it, how cute. So, and then you just open up your little bag and you have your quilty scraps. I love this. Do you have any idea how many scraps I have at this moment in time? <laughs> too many, too many. Um, I actually ended up buying a big 10 for my, my scraps. So this will actually come in quite handy, especially for the ones that I might wanna, you know, save for a project or else put up for sale in my Etsy store. It helps get everything nice and organized. Oh, I'm loving this. This is cool. All right. And then we have, this is the Jolly Bar Sun Washed Collection, as you can see right here. So beautiful. Now I did open up my um, Bountiful quilt kit that I purchased. And that was in the big, beautiful butterfly box, if you'll remember correctly. Um, but these are, the name of that fabric line is Sun Washed by Corey Yoder. And it is, it's beautiful. I can't wait to start cutting into it. So I'll be showing you the new, uh, how to put that block together here very soon since it's gonna go live before you know it. <laughs> so there's that. And then here's another quilt pattern. And this one is the Al Fresco quilt pattern. It's gorgeous. It's using the Jolly Bar and the um, Sun Washed fabric collection once again. Beautiful, beautiful. I love this. Uh, stars are one of my favorite patterns ever. I just, I love the look of stars. It is such a, to me, when I think of quilts, I think of stars. Um, it is so beautiful because it's so simple and yet just gorgeous and antique looking. And I just, I love the stars. So I think I might make this one. This one's really neat, really neat. I love it, love it, love it. This is cool. I'm gonna, I'm sorry, I'm in awe over here and I'm just reading and reading and reading. <laughs> okay, so this is also for the Bliss Quilt Along and they give you the instructions on what you need in order to make block number 11 for this month. So, what do you think? Do you get um, the, the Sew Sampler box too? Um, I know some of you commented last time and said that you do, and I think that's really neat. Um, 
tell me below what your favorite part of this box is because I'm really interested. I know what my favorite part of the box is, but I want to hear what yours is. So, I'm trying to put everything together here. Anyway, anyway, geez, I can't even speak today either. It's been too busy thinking about other things, I guess. So, anyway, that is what I have today. I am also going to be starting um, to go live more often and I'm going to be using a streaming service from now on that will allow me to stream from on um, Facebook on my page, my business page, Facebook group that I have also here on YouTube. So if you are in one of those places and I go live, you'll be able to catch me in one of them. So just giving you a little bit of more choices to, um, to watch along and follow along. So if you would like to um, purchase one of these sew sampler boxes and get on the subscription list, then I will link below down in the description box where you can get that from. If you'd like to follow me on social media, of course, links are down below in the description box. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to give the video a like. We are almost at, are you ready for this? 40,000 subscribers. I am currently like 38 away from it. I'm so excited. And I just have to thank you all because I could not have gotten to this point without all of you and your love and support. And so make sure you click the little bell. If you're new here, you'll get notified each and every time that I up upload an awesomely cool new video and keep on crafting. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.